Welcome to another exciting episode of Stay Smooth Shaving. Today I'll be doing a review of the Icon 102 Slant Head Razor. Now this is on loan from my brother-in-law, so I can test out whether I wanted to get it or not. Um, before I get into the razor, I'd like to tell you what I'm using with it. Sterling Soap Company Sharp Dress Man. Now. This is one of the first, maybe first to third soaps I bought. I think I bought uh, Trumper, not Trumpers, but uh, Tops. Then I went to um, How to Grow a Mustache. Then I went to Sterling, Katie's Bubble, something. It's been so long, not too short. But I had an, uh, one of the refill pucks, and I liked it so much that I went and bought another one, the 5.8. So you can get it between 8 to, I think it's 8 to $11, 11 dollars 11 75 Five point ounces, one of the steels out there and shaped them. Great stuff. I also used their aftershave balm or aftershave and their aftershave balm. This is a great combo, especially for the winter. A little uh, tip for you guys that have dry skin uh, that do like an aftershave, um, but want to keep your skin nice and supple and not so flaky. Pair it with an aftershave balm, and this combo is awesome. I think this is uh, the two ounce is like four bucks. This is under ten, I think, ten or eleven bucks. You cannot go wrong, I'm telling you. And this scent is the Green Irish Tweed. Ah, good stuff, my friends. Good stuff, good stuff. But today is the Icon Slant Head Razor. Now I believe my brother-in-law picked this up in New York again at Pastor's Pharmacy. He was going wild that day. Uh, before I get into that, I'd like to say, hope you guys are doing well, having a great day and a great shave. So moving on, I got to be honest here, um, I have to pride myself on being honest with these reviews to give people out there that are looking to buy these soaps, to buy these products, have a great range to, to gauge on, okay? I'm not blowing smoke it, but up anybody's um, rear, pardon the the pun there but uh, just just let you letting you know to out there to realize that I, I have no favoritism either way now that being said I do own an icon I own the 101 half open comb half straight bar and I love that razor this one I did not love so much I'm just gonna be out there it's 85 bucks it's Claimed to be a beginner's straight bar. Um, it was very mild. To me, it wasn't very smooth at all. The shave I got was minimal. I think the only pleasurable thing I got from the shave was the soap. Now, I'm not knocking Icon, because I do have one. But for me, for my skin, you're better off going with the McCour, with an s and s Fourteen dollar. I got a better shave with that SNS fourteen dollar eBay razor. So there you go. I mean, I don't know what else to say. It's a beautiful razor, great gnarling. Um, for me, I wouldn't use it. I wouldn't uh, um, recommend it for someone that's looking for a slant. Um, you get more um, performance out of the thirty seven C from a core, in my opinion. Now that is a little more aggressive, so if you're looking for a mild razor and you're wanting to spend some money, I mean, if you want to get it, go right ahead, but you'll get just as good a shave with the straight bar razor, um, in my opinion. Um, yeah, that that's it. I mean, I can't say nothing bad about the razor, and I can't say nothing good about the razor. It's just okay, in my opinion. Um, for this type of razor, what it gave me, I would, I would only want to pay like 25 bucks for this razor, and it's 85 But the fit and finish on this is outstanding. A good looking razor, if that's what you're into. So, I will not recommend this razor for someone that's looking for a slant or is looking for a, an upgrade. Uh, I'd rather, rather you recommend to get a uh, the 101 
if you're going to go for icon, but if you're looking for a slant, this is very mild. So I would go get something else if you want an aggressive slant razor. But if you're looking for mild, get this one if you want to spend 85 bucks. But that being said, there you go. That's my opinion on the 102 slant razor. And I know there's a lot of people out there that like it, and I'm going to get bashed about it. It's all right. I'm a big boy. I can take it. But that's just my opinion. If you have another opinion, more power to you. Go shave with it, my friends. Um, the Sterling Soap Company has a bomb winner here. I've always liked this one from the beginning. It's a cologne-type scent. I love it. I know there's a lot of people out there that don't love cologne-type scents. I'm one of those guys. I don't like bay rum. I don't, I'm not a fan of sandalwood. I know. Whoa. Um, I do have a sandalwood. Um, and it's tolerable for me. So I'll give it to that. But I'm not a fan of those types of scents. Um, flowery types of scents I'm not into. So when I like something, just know that I like cologne type scents. And this is a take on the Green Irish Tweed. I wish I would be willing to spend a hundred bucks to get the actual cologne or a hundred and some. I don't know what it is now. It's pretty pricey, but this one is a great soap for slickness. It's up there. It's about a 9.4 slickness cushion, 9.4, um, poche face. So I'll give it a nine. The scent is a 10 for me. I love this scent. <sighs> Just smells like a man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The ladies will love you for it. Believe you me. And the scent strength is not bad at about a 5.9. So overall, I'm going to give Sharp Dress Man from Sterling, one of my first, my very first Sterling soap, a 9.5. Would have gave it a 10, but there, there's stoves out there now that I know that are a little more uh, better in post-shave, whatnot. So that's the only reason I do it that way. The aftershave is great. It's a 10. The aftershave bombs a 10 as well. I love Sterling. It is definitely running up my list of great shoes and accoutrements. So that is the show today. Icon 102 Slant Razor. It was okay. I don't know how else to put it. If you like it, go rock with it. It was okay in my opinion. I wouldn't pay for it. Uh, no offense to who has them. Go get you some or go, go, go rock you some. Definitely pick up, pick up some Sterling. I know you will enjoy it. If you like cologne type scents, this is one you need to have in your den. Okay, that is the show today. Hope you had fun today. Until next time, respect yourself, respect the day, respect others. Until then, you smell with the smoothest cooking.